Hello everyone. Let's solve this problem right away. We have 9 to the power of 4 to the power of x equals 4 to the power of 9 to the power of x. The first thing I will do is taking the log of both sides. So I have logarithm of 9 to the power of x logarithm to the power of nine, um, 4 to the power of x. That will be log of 4 to the power of 9 to the power of x. And now, what do I do with the powers? Remember, if you have log a to the power of b, this is the same thing as b log a. So, because of this, I will take the power behind. So, I will have 4 to the power of x log 9 equal to 9 to the power of x log 4. Now the next thing I will do is dividing both sides by log 9. Now divide this by log 9. This cancels this. Now we have 4 to the power of x equal to 9 to the power of x log 4 divided by log 9. Okay, the, ne the next thing I will do is dividing both sides by 9 to the power of x. So from here, I will have um, 4 to the power of x divided by 9 to the power of x, right? And this will be equal to 9 to the power of x log 4 over log 9 multiply by 1 over 9 to the power of x. This way, 9 to the power of x will cancel 9 to the power of x. And we are now having 4 to the power of x over 9 to the power of x equal to log 4 over log 9. This is what I have. And from here, I want to take a step further. Remember that, um, you know, if you have this, 4 is the same thing as 2 squared. And 9 is the same thing as 3 squared. Now, let's put this value into the problem. So, we have um, 2 to the power of 2x over 3 to the power of 2x because 4 is 2 squared and 3 is um, 9 is 3 squared, right? This will be equal to log 4 becomes log 2 squared over log 9 is log 3 squared, right? And from here, remember what I said about the power? Okay, let me take a step with the left hand side. Remember that if you have a to the power of m over b over b to the power of m this is the same thing as a over b both of them raised to the power of m okay okay both of them raised to the power of m like this so i'll apply the same principle to this so that's from here i'm going to have 2 over 3 both raised to the power of 2x equal to, from here, the powers always go behind. So I will have, um, I'm going to have 2 log 2 over 2 log 3. Now 2 will cancel 2. And then we have 2 over 3. We have 2 over 3 to the power of 2x equal to log 2 over log um, 3. And there's this thing about log again, that if you have um, log a, okay, this is a over log b, it is the same thing as log a to base b. 
okay log a over log b is the same thing as log a to base b and because of that i'm going to work on this log here so here i have 2 over 3 to the power of 2x equal to log 2 to the base of 3 so this is what i have and from here i take a step from here the next thing that i will do is taking the log of both sides again right so that if i do that i'm going to have log 2 over 3 to the power of 2x equal to log from brackets log of 2 to the base of 3 right i'm taking logs again and then the next thing i'll do is that the power would always go behind so i have 2x log 2 okay log 2 to the base of 3 okay that's log 2 over 3 log 2 over 3 right equal to log to the log of 2 to base 3 okay so this is what we have now from here we need to make 2x the subject first by dividing both sides by log by log 2 over 3 okay then we we'll divide the whole of this by log 2 over 3 right now log 2 over 3 cancels log 2 over 3 and then 2x will be equal to log into log 2 to base 3 divided by log 2 over 3. Now, what do I do from here? There's this thing I said before that if you have, okay, let me write it over here, that if you have um, log A over log B, as, as far as they have the same base, it will be equal to log A to the base of B. Now, I will apply the same principle here so that I will get 2x to be equal to log, okay, log into log of, let me have brackets here, log 2 to base 3 to the base of 2 over 3. Okay, so we have log into log of 2 to base 3 over log 2 over 3. Now, this will become the base to the numerator. And that's what I did. Log into log 2 over 3 to the base of 2 over 3. I hope this is understandable. Now, the next thing is for us to divide both sides by 2. So, this is what I will do. I will have 2x divided by 2 equal to log into log 2 to base 3 to the base of 2 over 3 and we are dividing it by 2 that means we have to multiply it by half 1 over 2 so from here this will cancel this and then x will be equal to i want to bring 1 over 2 first so it becomes 1 over 2 log, open bracket, log 2 to base 3, okay, to the base of 2 over 3. So this is the value of x that, satisfy, that satisfies the given equation. And if you want to have this in decimal, you can press on your calculator and you have the value in decimal.